Hey guys, this is John from LM Marine. Behind me here, we have the brand new Skeeter SX2550 Bay Boat. Uh, this boat is really unique. It has a really tall, real proud bow design, Carolina flare. Uh, and actually, you can see that flare actually carries itself all the way to the aft of the boat. So, you know, that's going to really uh, be a dry riding hole. Uh, really excited about you know some of the features that this boat has to really bridge the gap between you know a serious angler and a family guy. There's a lot of family features in it. Um, you know we'll start you know out here in the back. So Skeeter actually designs this swim platform. Um, you know when you're at the sandbar, it's super easy to use. You have a step down ladder goes all the way down. Um, you have rubber up top, make it super comfortable for you. And what's really unique is that you'll notice. A lot of swim platforms you really can't do with twin power poles. Well, this boat is optioned with twin power pole blade 10 foots. Uh, you know, so that's really unique that everything works, everything has clearance, so you're good there. Uh, this particular boat does have the family package. So underneath us, we have the Linco, uh, I'm sorry, we have uh, Lumatech underwater lights. So that works really well. In conjunction, we do have Bennett, their electric tabs underneath there too. Of course, we also have the Yamaha 300. Uh, great performance out of this hole. You know, with the hardtop, which is actually on order for this boat, and it comes with the family package option. You know, full load, we're seeing low 50s to mid 50s as far as your performance there. Uh, of course, hydraulic jack plate as well. As we kind of work our way back up front, you'll notice that it's riding on the Skeeter built trailer. Great trailer. You'll have grab rails that come with the family package, LED navigation lights, the, the cat eye style LED light, so you can see, everybody can see you, so big safety benefit there. And big thing that they've designed in how Skeeter did is these trolling motors are getting bigger and bigger. So what's really unique is that, you know, 112 pound Minn Kota trolling motor, they're heavy. So uh, traditionally, you know, they've been kind of have to be mounted towards the front of the boat. So there's some kind of leverage in rough water uh, and or docking that kind of is in the way. So what's really unique is that you have this quick pin that you can pull and it'll slide all the way out for your, like your fishing position. And then any time that you're just navigating or playing on the sandbar or whatever, you can pull that pin, slides all the way back. Well guys, we're gonna jump inside the boat, check out some of those features and options inside. All right, guys, we're top side and we're looking on the bow of the SX2550 right now. And again, this boat is optioned with the family package. So you're seeing the forward seating option that is available. Um, as I kind of talk, I'll roll in some pictures of the boat without the cushions and without the table. But you'll see that, uh, you know, this table is completely removable. You'll also see some different positions that you can move this deck down and for like an elevated uh, platform if you want to have a larger casting deck up front which would make this casting deck just huge uh, and or just a, a, a better platform for more additional seating um, and then of course it's completely removable as well uh, port and starboard all these cushions do come up center line just folds over and of course you can remove these cushions and starboard side you have a rod box with a sea deck material down below Everything's riding on uh, stainless steel gas struts, stainless steel latches, and of course a huge rod, uh, rod tube is in the forward part of this box, so you have you know great room for all kinds of rods and reel combos. Right here, dry storage as well, same C deck material. And port side is just in a, a secondary box to the one that you just saw on the starboard side. And underneath the cushions there, we'll have a large anchor box. So large anchor box there. Underneath me here, we do have a large kill box with a macerator pump out as well. And of course, you'll notice little features and options too, like uh, the grab rails up front. You'll see pop-up cleats. And throughout the boat, the rod holders are using is a rod holder cup holder combination. Works great. All right, guys, we're in front of the console now. So in front of the console, we do have an Engel cooler right here with a matching vinyl cushion in front. And of course, obviously, Engel makes a great cooler. Uh, really comfortable uh, sitting option with grab rails right here. Uh, as we come around to the port side of this console, let Zach catch up. 
we got the access to this privacy console. This is a great privacy console. We got plenty of room to get to everything you need. If you wanted to have a portable head down there, you certainly got room enough to do that. Of course, your electrical panel that Zach showcased right there with your breakers. And then you can pop this out and get to that. LED lighting, great setup there, really unique. So right here, we're behind uh, on the back side of this console. Uh, we got room for whatever electronics you want. Uh, I believe this boat's gonna be optioned out with the Simrad, um, but we do Garmin Hummingbird as well at l and Marine. Of course, we do have a sea deck pad, so if you wanted to do like a viewing tower or something different, and uh, you know, now that I mentioned it, this boat is optioned with that family package of hardtop, okay? So we have Yamaha displays, digital display here for all your engine information, elevator switches. Those switches are gonna um, function a lot of those LED lights and features that are gonna be on the hardtop. And then of course you got Skeeter's electrical panel that's built into their console as well. Uh, Fusion stereo, our trim tab, trim tab switching right here with indicator, LED backlit indicator switch. Tilt steering, um, you do have a hydraulic jack plate on this boat, so that's gonna you know, give you the ability to con control that on the fly. And of course, what's really nice, you do have that little Skeeter uh, seat deck pad right here and a really nice helm pad below too. All right guys, so we're looking at the helm sitting now. Uh, Skeeter has this lean and post live wheel that's optioned with this SX2550. It's very comfortable. Got a fold down pad, fold down footrest right here, and of course, uh, fold down armrest as well. Of course, behind here we have the live wheel. Huge live wheel riding on Gym Lux hardware, slam latch with additional rod storage. All right guys, so we just wanted to showcase this uh, bolstered pad that runs all the way from the front deck all the way back on top of your gunnels or on the side of your gunnels here. Makes it very comfortable if you wanted to bottom fish, just dealing with dock lines, I really like that feature. Underneath that is where they mounted your hose coil for your wash down pump. So that makes it really easy to get to. Um, as we move back, you will have under gunnel rod storage as well. Of course, it's really nice that Skeeter puts and incorporates this little step to get to your rear deck. Uh, right here is also this Skeeter, the uh, 2550, has a freshwater wash down. Really makes it hot, uh, really nice on those hot days. And of course, rear deck, jump seats. And with the uh, family package, we got the, the middle seat that goes over your live well. This is just a removable cushion, but with everything in place, you could seat probably four people, maybe even five. Of course, all of this will come off. I'll show you that real quick. And then now we got a fishing deck. And of course, same thing will, is similar to what's up front. You know, all the cushions up front remove as well. Um, dry storage on this boat. We have a little shallow dry storage box right here to keep like dock lines. Makes it easier reaching inside the boat, getting dock lines or anything like that. It's great for that. Of course, these boxes can be removed too if you want to get a little bit more access to your systems. Live well. So on this particular setup with the two live wells we have here, huge live well systems, uh, you know, for all kind of bait, for offshore fishing, inshore fishing, tournaments, it works great. Uh, with in, conduct, in uh, conjunction with the Lena Post Live Well. You know, once we remove the backrest, we have additional rod storage. Real deep dry storage box right here. So all your Coast Guard equipment be a great place for that. And then great bilge access. For all your seat cocks, your power pole pumps, you also have, you know, Yamaha water separator, all your systems of your boat are below. Well guys, that about wraps it up on the Skeeter SX2550. Uh, if you want any more information on this boat, best place to reach us is always going to be call first at 251-937-1380. Or you can view our inventory 24 hours a day at www.southernfishingboats.com. Thank you guys for watching.